Yo, it's me, Dead Carpet, and this is Dead Carpet Energy Drink Reviews, and it's 11.06 a.m., and it's Thursday, February 15th, 2024. Yesterday was Valentine's Day, and, um, the day before yesterday I shaved, so, yeah, but, um, anyway, yesterday I went to Walmart, and I was surprised to see this. It's another new flavor of the Aspire Healthy Energy Energy Drinks. A couple weeks ago, I reviewed the new Strawberry Watermelon one, but this one has a similar can design. It's, like, the same, like, reddish color, but the A's a little bit more of, like, a like a maroon or a burgundy color. It's like a darker red, you know? But um, anyway, this one sounds like it might be pretty good. We shall see. I already reviewed a flavor that was sort of similar to this. It was like the, um, I think it was like the black cherry limeade one. But this one's a different one. This one's just regular cherry, not cherry limeade. But um, anyway, today I'm gonna be reviewing the new Sweet Cherry Aspire Healthy Energy Energy Drink. So, oh yeah, boys, look at that can. So, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. It's a little bit reflective, but oh yeah. I mean, it has a silver top with silver tab bombs and Best Buy Damn Production Code. Best Buy November 17th, 2025. So it's still fresh for a while. It's like curved. How it's like printed. Aspire Healthy Energy. Crisp, light taste with a sparkling finish. 80 milligrams natural caffeine, zero sugar calories. Has a big swooping A. And shows some cherry, sweet cherry flared with other natural flavors. 12 foot ounces, 355 milliliters. Drink. Just says drink, it doesn't say energy drink. Um, but it has like a, some bubbles and looks like some fireworks or something. Like an explosion type of design. I don't know. Looks pretty cool though. Cool looking can. But yeah, it's a little bit dented. But um, this is the best condition can that they had. But um, it was like $1.98. So basically $2 for one can. So I guess okay priced. But um, anyway. Aspire every day, you're radiant ready, perfectly energized, 80 milligrams natural caffeine from green tea and guarana, clear and focus, B and C vitamins and nutrients, feeling great, zero sugar, zero calories, crisp light taste, keto friendly, vegan, gluten free, kosher, and soy free, learn more at AspireDrinks.com. And it shows some more bubbles and stuff, it has a crown logo, some other codes in the SKU, um, contains 0% juice. Nutrition facts are says one can, 12 foot ounces, 355 milliliters, amount for certain calories, zero. Total fat, zero grams, zero percent, 355 milligrams, three percent. Total carbohydrate, zero grams, zero percent. Total sugar, zero grams. Includes zero grams, added sugar, zero percent. Protein, zero grams. Calcium, 26 milligrams, two percent. Myosin, 11 milligrams, 70 percent. Vitamin C, 63 milligrams, 70 percent. Vitamin B6, 3.4 milligrams, 200 percent. Vitamin B12, 1.7 micrograms, 70 percent. Biotin, 8 micrograms, 25 percent. Panathenic acid, 4 milligrams, 80%. Cholin, 33 milligrams, 6%. Then it has other ingredients, carbonated water, citric acid, taurine, vegetable juice for color, sodium citrate, calcium lactate, guarana seed extract, azorbic acid, green tea extract, natural caffeine, cholin but tartrate, natural flavor, sucralose, L-carnitine, green tea, polyphenols, EGCG, ginger root extract, niacinamide, decalcium panathenate, pyroxene hydrochloride, biotin and cyanocobalamin, stirred by Aspire Brands Incorporated, Chicago, Illinois, 60642, made in the USA. So yeah, it has that green tea EGCG, so um, sort of like the Celsius drink and stuff, it's like a, a little bit of a thermogenic energy drink. It's going to also help you burn a little bit more calories, you know, when you exercise and stuff. Um, but yeah, 80 milligrams natural caffeine, like a cup of coffee, not recommended for children. Sorry, not recommended for children, people sensitive to caffeine, pregnant or nursing women. The, F the FDA suggests limiting daily caffeine consumption to approximately 400 milligrams per day from all sources. Please recycle has a recycling logo. So yeah, that's pretty much the entire can, so what you see it real quick, I already showed you the top and the bottom. But um, anyway, I'll show it off up close to though in a minute, so you can see it a little bit better. It's like not as reflective, you know? A little bit better lighting. I don't know why this reminds me of like some of that like futurism stuff, like 1920s, like um... Like the vintage text and stuff. Oh, it reminds me of like the World's Fair and stuff. Like that type of design, you know. It looks a little bit nostalgic, but um, I'm not for sure if I like these newer can designs or like the older can designs better. Just the SKU and stuff. Because the older cans are reminding me of like my grandma's like tablecloths and stuff. They had like fall leaves and stuff. But now it has like a swooping A and stuff. Yeah, there's the other ingredients. 
the morning and stuff. Okay, that's pretty much the entire can. And right now I'm gonna show off the can up closer quick. So hold on that. The new sweet cherry aspire healthy energy energy drink. Looks similar to the um new watermelon one I reviewed recently. Strawberry watermelon, but um anyway. Same red and white can design with bubbles. Looks like a firework or something. Unlike the swoopy A. That's 80 milligrams of caffeine. Not a whole lot. Yeah, silver top, silver tab. Bomb specified by date and production code. This by November 17th, 2025, so it's still fresh for a while. Sweet cherry. Keto friendly, vegan, gluten free, kosher, soy free. Other codes, the crown logo and the SKU. Now for the nutrition facts side. Other ingredients and the distributor information. The warning and stuff. Okay, that's pretty much the entire can. Anyway, now I'm going to finish my review for it, so hold on a minute. Okay, I start off the can up close and I'm going to shake it up a little bit. Open it, taste it, and give my review for it. So hold on a minute. Okay, did not explode. And the color is definitely like a cherry color. It's like a, um, a reddish hot pink color. Maybe a little bit purplish. It looks similar to I think I had like um, a few days ago. A little bit bubbly where I shook it up. It's like a hot pinkish, reddish, purplish color. Um, so yeah. But I'm um, anyway, the scent, oh, I can already smell it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. It smells actually pretty similar to like, um, I think it was like one of the Petey's Bing cherry drinks. Um, has a little bit of like a cherry yogurty sort of scent. Yeah, like cherry yogurt or like, um, yeah, a lot like, um, like the cherry cheesecake, um, yo play whips and stuff, or like um, that cherry yogurt with like the cherry pieces in it, you know. Oh, it reminds me of that, like a creamy sort of cherry scent. But um, you know, it says it's um sweet cherry. It's actually a little bit more of like a black cherry sort of scent. So it's a little bit like a black cherry yogurt, I guess. Um, yep, still some really strong cherry scent. But yeah, it's a little bit like a darker cherry though. Not like a normal cherry. Um, still smells really good though. Cherry's like um one of my favorite types of energy drinks. Um, but yeah, it smells pretty good. Um, but um, anyway, I'm not gonna try it. So here goes. Oh yeah, boys. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, it does have a little bit of like a black cherry yogurt sort of taste, but um, even though it says it doesn't have any juice in it, it actually has a little bit of like a real juice sort of taste. Um, I think I had like a cherry um, something Minute Maid type of drink before. It was like a mixture of like cherry and something. But um, it's like in one of those big cartons, you know? I think it was by Minute Maid. I think it actually was by Dole, I think. Um. Yeah, it reminds me of that though. It's like um, it was like cherry um, I think it was like cherry cranberry. But um, this reminds me of that a little bit. It has a little bit of like a yeah, like a juice sort of taste. Um, but yeah, it has a little bit of a creaminess to it. Not really texture wise, but um, flavor wise. Um, texture wise, it's actually um, pretty smooth. It's not too carbonated. You can probably check it if you want to. Reminds me of like um. Mountain Dew kickstarts, like texture wise, it's like lightly carbonated, a little bit of like a, a little bit of like a sparkling sort of drink, but um, not bad though. Um, but yeah, it's actually pretty good, very sweet, but um, also a little bit um, tart at the same time. It's definitely more like black cherry than normal cherry, but um, still really good though, really flavorful. 
Um, but yeah, it's a little bit like a lighter energy drink though. So this is a little bit like more healthy for you and stuff. And yeah, it can also help you burn a little bit more calories, you know, when you exercise too, because it's a little bit thermogenic. Um, but yeah, it has a cool can design. It's okay price, like around two dollars at Walmart. It's brand new. Um, marriage wise, um, it's high in B vitamins, but only has 80 milligrams caffeine. So it's still saying energy wise, lasts about two hours. Well, actually, two and a half hours, about three and a half hours of energy. So, oh yeah, boys, it'll still definitely get you lit. So, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Energy wise, it works pretty good. It has a cool can design, tastes good. Um, yeah, it has a little bit of like a healthy sort of taste. Not really like an earthy, like healthy type of taste, but um, a little bit more like a real juice sort of taste. It reminds me of, yeah, like um, like that cherry um, cranberry, like um, dull juice, or like um, a little bit like um, a little bit like a juicy juice. I think I had black cherry juicy juice before. This reminds me of that team bit. Um, but yeah, it's pretty flavorful. Um, maybe it could be a little bit sweeter, but um, still pretty good though. It's definitely more of like a lighter tasting drink. Um, so I wish it was a little bit stronger, like flavor wise, but um, still pretty good. Um, but yeah, I'd probably give the new Sweet Cherry Aspire Healthy Energy Energy Drink. It's pretty good, but um, I don't think it's my favorite one of these Aspire drinks. Um, I actually think I like the um, Strawberry Watermelon one I reviewed a couple weeks ago. Maybe a team bit more than this one, but this one's still really good though. But yeah, I'd probably give the Sweet Cherry Aspire Healthy Energy Energy Drink. You know what, boys, you know what, I'm going to give it a 9 out of 10. So, oh yeah, boys, it's lit. So, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, I'm going to give it a 9 out of 10. Oh yeah, it's a cool can design, tastes good, Orange Wars works pretty good. Um, could be a little bit better, but I'm still really good, though. It definitely has more of like a natural juice sort taste, even though it doesn't have any juice in it. Um, but yeah, pretty good. But yeah, I'm going to give it a 9 out of 10. Like a little bit like black cherry yogurt juice, I guess. Um, so yeah, I'm going to give it a 9 out of 10. So, oh yeah, boys, it's lit. So, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, I'm going to give it a 9 out of 10. Oh yeah. Well, in my next review, I'm going to be reviewing the new Galaxy Vibe Celsius Energy Drink. I finally got it. So stay tuned for that review. So, I'm going to review some more videos. Thanks for watching. See you guys later. Peace out. And bye.